Turning now to the ongoing coronavirus pandemic, the risk of spreading COVID-19 has forced many to get creative in how to celebrate the holidays, including Halloween. NBC 15's Laura Barcheski spoke with one mobile woman who changed things up this year to make sure Halloween was both safe and fun for everyone. Laura's live there tonight. Laura. Jaysha, Catherine Load says she always goes all out for Halloween. And this year, even though it was a little bit different, she made she found a safe way to hand out treats to the whole neighborhood. Halloween may not look a whole lot different on the outside this year, but the way people celebrate has changed due to COVID-19. Because I usually have this all uh, roped off and I let the kids come in and walk through the yard. But this year, because of COVID, I'm just going to give it out at the gate so they won't have to stand around and everything. They can just get it and go. Mobile resident Catherine Lode wore a mask and gloves to hand out candy and asked those who visited her house to also wear masks. Instead of walking, we are driving. We make sure it's not a crowded place when we walk into the houses. Trick or treat! Oh! Trick or treat! There you go, baby! Parents say they were determined to make this holiday as fun as possible for their children while doing their best to be safe. She has been very excited. Well, my daddy used to bring her every year before he passed, and we try to keep the tradition. Lode says both the kids and their parents needed a little bit of happiness during these tough times. And it brings so much joy to so many people, young, old, even teenagers. <laughs> they love it. And just to deprive them of not being able to get their treats this year was just too much. You know, I wanted to try to make them happy. Others who didn't hand out candy at the door left them in little treat bags in a basket for people to pick up themselves. But everyone I talked to found a safe way to celebrate Halloween tonight. Reporting live in Mobile, Laura Barcheski, NBC 15 News.